guys, I hope you're all well, and by well I mean feeling much better than I am today. I'm afraid this is a genuine sick day routine video because I've not been feeling too good recently. So I start the day with loads of flu medicine, starting with some Lemsip. I find this just helps to clear everything out. Then I have a big glass of water from my filter. Um, it's good to keep hydrated throughout the day when you're ill. And also if you can have some vitamins in the form of a juice maybe, I find that really helps. Then I'm taking some tablets. These are the Sainsbury's cold and flu ones. They work really well and much cheaper than the Lemsip version. Then I run myself a bath and I'm using some West Lab Epsom salts because I find these are really good at just relieving any aching muscles. Everything tends to ache when I'm ill, so these are really nice. They don't have a smell, so I add some Calm One, Calm All from Soap and Glory to make it all bubbly, even though I can't really smell the bath water because my nose is blocked. Then I clean my face using the Pixie um, face wipes. I love these ones because they're really soft and they stay really moisturised thanks to the um, closure on the packet. And I just clean my face. Oh, my nose is so red from all the blowing. Then it's into the bath I get. Look at those tan lines. And I'm using the Sanctuary Spa Butter Facial Cleanser because it's so soft and it just feels lovely and pampering and gentle on my skin rinsing that off with some water and then I'm washing my hair. I'm using the L'Oreal Mythic Oil range just because it means that my hair is really easy to detangle, really soft and I don't need to spend ages brushing it afterwards. I'm using the um, mask from the same range afterwards all through the ends and then I'm just going to brush that through. So I tie my hair into a bit of a loose bun while I relax in the bath. And then I'm going to be using some Urban Veda products because they're all natural skincare and I just like to be natural when I'm not feeling very well. This one is a scrub and it leaves my skin feeling really tingly and it has a mint smell and it's one of the only smells that I can actually smell. I'm using the same brand's body lotion. This is just really lovely and gentle, sinks in really quickly as well but it's still really lovely and luxurious. Then it's into my dressing gown, I just want to be super comfy today and of course my lovely little emu slippers. Then, because I don't really like that whole sick room vibe, I'm making it smell nice with a molten brown room spray. Um, I just spritz it all over, I find it helps make the room feel a little bit less stuffy. And then I'm lighting my Neom Happiness candle. I can't smell it, but anybody coming into the room can, so it's nice to make the room a little bit, little bit more atmospheric. And I'm also using a Neil's Yard um, room fragrance drops in this contraption which Charlie is obsessed with. <laughs> then I'm towel drying my hair and putting in some Manuka oil from Palmer's. Again this means that I can just run through my hair with a hairbrush or tangle teaser really really easily. So I am going to do a little bit of skincare and makeup, just my usual routine, trying to hide my dressing gown sleeves that I which Dexter has chewed. This is my La Prairie serum which I use pretty much every day at the moment. No point in changing your serum. And then my usual Liz Earl Super Skin Eye Cream as well. I'm also using some eye drops from BioTrue because my eyes are a little bit itchy. And then the Make a Difference Moisturizer from Origins. It's actually a gel moisturizer um, because my skin's a little bit warm. Now I'm using a cream from Neil's Yard. I actually picked up the wrong one. It's meant to be a soothing cream, putting that on my nose. Um, and then a little bit of makeup just to make me feel a bit more human, starting with the Clarence BB Cream. I'm just using a Zoeva brush, a really big one to blend that in, really quick and easy. And some bronzer to add some life back into my face. This is the Estee Lord Bronze Goddess. Again, this is just to make me look half alive. I'm not going to leave the house today. Then, to attempt to hide those massive puffy eyes, I'm using the L'Oreal True Match Concealer. And I'm blending it in firstly with my fingers and then the Spectrum blending sponge which I got in this month's Birch Box. I really like that for flawless finish. And then of course I'm going to do my brows using the MAC Brow Pencil and Benefit Gimme Brow. Again this is just purely so that when I look in the mirror or answer the door I don't look like a complete zombie. On my eyelids I'm using a neutral shade from the Urban Decay Gwen Stefani palette. And then I'm also using a lighter shade just in the corners of my eyes and this helps to make them look a little bit brighter, makes me look a little bit more awake even if I don't feel it. 
Finally, my normal mascara, just one layer of the Rimmel Volume Colorist. This is just a mascara I use on an everyday basis. Sometimes I layer it up, but not today. I just want to look more awake. And then this stuff, the Elizabeth Arden 8 Hour Cream Lip Balm is my saviour. I apply this several times throughout the day. I love it. My lips always get so dry when I'm poorly, so I'm putting on loads of this stuff. Then it's back into the bedroom. All of my energy has been used up by doing my makeup, so opening the window to make some fresh air come into the room. Onto my laptop, checking my email mountain isn't overflowing, probably sticking on some Netflix. Then I spot that Dexter's come in, so I give him some cuddles. I definitely recommend puppy cuddles if you're poorly, it always helps. I'm also reading a book just to try and fall asleep really. Sleeping always helps when you're ill. More puppy kisses and I'm pretty much just going to kiss Dexter for the rest of the day. Now I'm going to have a nap, hopefully I'll feel better when I wake up. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you're feeling poorly then I hope you feel better soon. See you next time, bye!